Medical waste is one of the waste type which contain infectious materials. These wastes are very dangerous if they are not recycled and disposed properly. They may spread viruses and bacteria. That's why special countermeasures are needed. Two years ago, Indonesia had been hit by COVID-19, which resulted in the rise of medical waste pollution. Indonesian locals have found medical waste with regular waste mixed together in the Indonesian landfill. It's a problem across Indonesia that almost 493 tons of COVID-related waste is being produced every single day. Not just landfill, river and water waste are awash with medical waste, putting the environment and population at serious health risk. Medical waste cannot be handled carelessly. It is dangerous if we try to pick it up with our bare hands because it contains bacteria and possible viruses that could infect us. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello, honorable judges and audiences. I'm Kal Aurelia Juanda. And I'm Lakisha Nayara Aurelia. And we're from Pribadi Bilingual Boarding School, Bandung. Today, we're going to explain our research with the title Medical Waste Sorting Robot, Arduino and Voice Based Sensor. From the problem we have explained previously, we decided to do research on finding the best way how to process medical waste without touching it directly, but instead using Arduino. By using the Arduino-based robot, sorting medical waste may be done efficiently. Arduino is an open-source electronic platform and often used to design and create electronic devices as well as software, for example, to operate a robot. Our problem formulation in this research are 1. How to handle medical waste in an eco-friendly way 2. How to group the medical waste without the hands direct touch 3. Why are waste, especially medical waste, are very dangerous for the environment 4. How effective is the use of medical waste sorting robot using Arduino system towards sorting and managing the medical waste? The pre-research includes research stages 1 and 2 Next, the research development stage are 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Consists of assembling the robot, designing the base, programming the code, assembling the robot gripper, and combining the main part of the robot with the gripper. And lastly, stage 8 is testing the product. We tested several medical ways for the robot to pick up, such as mask, used needles, and syringes. As we can see here, the robot successfully picked up the trash as commanded. As you can see, the Arduino-based medical sorting robot is effective at handling medical waste in an eco-friendly way. The robot is capable of sorting the medical waste through a voice-based sensor connected to Bluetooth and is proven to be able to move and pick up the waste using the gripper by voice-based command. Based on this research, our suggestion is to add an ultrasonic sensor with the intent that the robot automatically can pick up the waste right in front of it. And it is also suggested to use the robot gripper made with stronger materials other than plastic or acrylic, so that it won't be easily damaged during testing and assembling session. That concludes the end of our presentation. We hope to develop our research even further. Thank, Thank you for your attention. attention. I'm Kayla. And I'm Lakisha. We're, We're saying, saying goodbye. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.